Hi everyone, today I am going to show you all how to make kada vegetable. For that, the needed ingredients are I have taken 3 uh, medium size carrot, 4 medium size uh, potato, and quarter cup of green peas, 1 beetroot, 1 white radish, handful of uh, beans, and uh, 2 small size capsicum, 1 small portion of cabbage. You can take any vegetables as you wish except um, capsicum and carrot. All the rest of the vegetables I have blanched and kept. These two are, I kept it raw. Okay, and for the gravy, we needed 2 medium size onion chopped and kept, 3 medium size tomato puree, and 1 inch uh, ginger chopped and kept, 2 green chilies chopped and kept, uh, 4 to 5 curry leaves chopped and kept, and 6 to 7 um, cashew nuts, and 1 tablespoon of melon seed. I made a paste out of this and kept. The masala for uh, making kada vegetables, I have taken uh, 2 uh, dry uh, red chilies and uh, 1 small piece of nutmeg, 1 javitri, this is nutmeg flour, 1 small piece of stone flour and 1 small piece of cinnamon and 1 black cardamom, this is 1 small piece of pineapple flour, um, 4 to 5 cloves and 1 half teaspoon of uh, fennel seed, half teaspoon of um, black pepper, a quarter teaspoon of uh, zira and uh, half teaspoon of um, coriander seeds and I have roasted all these items and made powder and kept for making the put in the curry and uh, I have taken um, kasuri methi one tablespoon and one teaspoon of um, um, cashmere chili powder and one teaspoon of coriander powder and salt to taste and for garnishing we need uh, chopped uh, I have taken uh, coriander chopped coriander and fresh cream Kada is hot and ready. I am pouring 1 tablespoon of oil and almost 1 teaspoon of butter. Let the butter melt. Now I am adding a little zira to it. I will add the chopped onion. First. And then ginger. Let these two become golden brown color. Until then we will cook it. We will wait for onion to go brown in color, nice and golden brown color. I am adding green chilies and tomato puree and half of the salt and half of the kadai masala what I made. We will mix this, we will wait for the um, oil to come out and make a nice gravy out of this. Now the onion and tomato is cooked nicely, we have a nice gravy and oil is coming out nicely. Now I am adding little turmeric powder and coriander powder and cashmere chilli powder and just mix for a minute. I am adding cut raw cabbage and raw capsicum. Mix it for a minute. I will add little water. And we will allow this to cook for us. Cook for some time. 
the capsicum and cabbage cook nicely now we will add one by one all the other vegetables add it these are all boiled already i mean blanched and kept potatoes beetroot radish beans and peas adding the salt and rest of the masala powder and mix for a minute little water mix it nicely and we we'll close this and cook for 5 minutes now all the vegetables together cooked nicely now i am adding the paste of uh, cashew nut and uh, melon seed and taking the kasuri methi and crushing a little bit and then adding to it and little bit of curry leaves also we'll mix this and then cover and let it cook for one or two minutes and cover this and i'll cook for two minutes we'll see after two minutes now kada vegetable is ready i'm going to transfer this to a serving bowl switch off the stove kada vegetable is ready and served in a serving bowl now i am going to garnish with little raw ginger pieces chopped coriander and little fresh cream you can just pour this fresh cream can add as much you want now our makada vegetable is ready hope you all enjoyed my video thank you very much for seeing my video bye